Okay, let me show you this horribly unorganized uh, electronic setup for the elevator. Everything is being controlled by this EFX Tech Prop 2. Uh, I have all this, a lot of other stuff, but it's all plugged into the uh, Prop 2. Now the uh, Prop 2 is powering uh, one set of lights, but it's not powering most of the other stuff. That's why you see all these wall warts and setups here. So what's going into the Prop 2 is some white lights, a string of white lights, a string of red lights, two electromagnets, uh, two servos, a uh, soundboard. So, oh, and uh, two separate triggers and a wall motor. So each of those, this little guy here connected to a wall wart. This is powering the two servos and also the string of white lights. The uh, white lights, there are 11 of those uh, ultra bright LEDs. Uh, that's a little bit too much for that guy to power by itself. So I've got the uh, a, uh, alternate power source here and they're just basically wired up there. Nothing special. Here I have a 12 volt source and a relay. This is going to the electromagnets. I have two sets of electromagnets. One on each side. Here's electromagnet here. This plate is really just a heat sink. I also have a uh, little fan here, a uh, computer fan hooked up to a 9 volt battery uh, just to help for the heat sinking. And what this does, you can see there is a pulley set up and my wedge here. So that electromagnet holds the wedge up until I'm ready to release it. <coughs> Here is my soundboard going to the speakers. Uh, this is a relay for the white lights. This is a relay for the sound card. Here are my triggers. I've got two separate triggers coming in. One trigger is this button here. And one trigger is this. Uh, magnetic sensor here that tells the uh, prop controller where the fabric loop is, when to start it, when to stop it. So all those are, you see these, there are three twisted wires here. One is ground, one is a signal for, for this button trigger, and one is a signal for this electromagnetic or magnetic sensor. Servo number one for the elevator dial. Servo number two for the cockroach. All right, so let's see everything in action. So I push the button, servo moves. Electromagnet drops. The motor starts running. The elevator dial is moving. Lights are flashing. The door is moving. Lights turn red. And you can see there's the, there's the magnet. Hits the sensor and stops. Lights are red at this point and doors open and you walk out. Now in about a minute, this whole thing is going to automatically reset. The motor will advance to the next magnet. Magnet Lights will turn red. This servo and this servo will reset. That's it.